What's up everyone, your friendly neighborhood once a guy here, back again with the second card reveal. Uh, today I'll only be reviewing two cards as due to the time schedule of the releases, all the other cards for today it will only actually be released tomorrow for me from starting from 1am. Um, and I'm not going to sit up and wait for all of those. So I will be dropping another video to review the cards that are being released overnight for me later tomorrow morning. Uh, so the cards that were revealed today, um, well, in my opinion, both very spicy and definitely picked up on one of the theories that I had looking at the last batch of cards. So first up here, we have another Colossal Minion, uh, Gigafin. He's an 8 mana, 7 for Murloc, for Warlock. Uh, with a battle cry, devour all minions, death rattle, spit them back out. And you see we summon Megafins more with that as well. That minion has taunt and its death rattle permanently destroy all minions inside Gigafin. So this is a great synergy. Um, especially if you want to you can kill off your own minion for heal lifesteal whatever um, and you can basically clear a board kill off your own minion and you know kill off the gigafins more and your opponent's board has disappeared so you kind of do want gigafins more obviously to obviously to die before gigafin um, it doesn't give it immune or you know it, it's not actually affected by uh, Gigafin isn't really affected by the more if it dies first uh, So it's actually better for it to die first in this sense so I can see this as a Very cool way to have a board clear and also get a pretty decent minion on board um, Again, if you're playing warlock and you know you you're kind of playing a self damage warlock you know you'll be running a lot of healing cards you know a lot of minion destruction cards you can easily just destroy gigafins more on the same turn if you want to um just in case if you're wondering if your opponent's gonna destroy your gigafin the next turn and essentially you've got a big board clear um and when it says it it devours all enemy minions i'm not sure if this kills them um because it has a death rattle to spit them back out so i'm not sure if this will trigger death rattles as yet just by the wording of the card i'm thinking it doesn't um so this is maybe a great way to stop those death rattle cards going off uh, in a lot of death rattle builds that i'd probably foresee coming we've had death rattle priest we've had um death rattle hunter in the past as well so if there is going to be another big death rattle build this is a very nice hard counter to those uh, death rattles going off um, even going up against the um, al otk warlock this is a super hard counter to that final board although usually that final board gets put out um, when they have their final attack so that final ball gets put out and they clear it on that same turn um, but if that doesn't happen, you could play this clear a board. Um, yeah, it's essentially a, basically a big board clear. However, you are getting two minions on board and you do run the risk of those minions coming back. Uh, but maybe they might not come back soon enough. So in my opinion, this is a great card. Uh, we'll see how it fits into the build. Again, we have now seen two Molochs for um, Warlock in this set so far. So maybe there's a total Murloc self damage Warlock build. I don't know. We'll wait and see until some more cards come out. So looking at our next card is another Colossal Minion. This is Colossal plus two. Uh, Gaia the Tectonic, an eight mana five seven minion mech for um, mage. And uh, yeah, it summons two Gaia's Drills which have rush and those are three mana two threes and like i said yesterday uh with the card we saw then the other mech we saw for uh mage that potentially we could potentially see uh, a mech mage build coming along and with this being included now again within uh, a mage card they are looking to maybe try and make mage mech a thing 
whether or not it's going to work, I don't know. Mages always relied on spells mostly and not minions. Um, although we have seen a bold coming along now, although it is called a uh, big spell mage, you do run most of your deck, uh, your deck is minions, um, and then you run big spells that helped, uh, and the minions help toot out those spells uh, and reduce the cost of those spells. So I don't think that having a big minion in a mage deck is going to be a bad thing especially if you've got a lot of synergy cards and a lot of other mechs that can synergize with this um, like we saw the battle cry for the other mech is uh, discover three mechs randomly so basically you add three mechs to your hand um, and with this it says after a friendly mech attacks deal one damage to all enemies which includes face so on the first turn you play this you can already um, deal two to all enemies because both of guys draws will have rush however if you have other mechs on board already say from uh, the, the the mechs you receive from the the other card you know this could deal a lot of damage in in one turn um, we could also see some mech cost reduction or just minion reduction cards coming out for mage which means you could tutor those out faster um, and if you've got a board full of even one one mechs or one two mechs with rush um, or you've had mechs on the board before once you've played this you can deal out a significant amount of damage i mean uh, on the turn you play this if you have already Let's see, so this summons another two that takes up three slots. If you already have another four mechs on board, um, you can do a total of six damage to all enemies. And that is quite significant in one turn, as well as summoning a big minion. Um, you may still have even mana left to play additional rush minions after that, if possible. If you get some rush mechs in there and dish out some additional damage from that, you can still probably play a spell if you are on 10 mana. So if we do get some more mech card synergies within Mage, I can definitely see Gaia being played um, alongside those, those cards. And I definitely want to see what other mechs come out because a minion-based mage deck a pure minion based mage deck hasn't been around for a while um and frankly the entire meta at the moment is very much based around spells you know um we've got the quest hunter you've got ramp druid kazakhstan druid you've got um quest warlock i mean you've got so many things at mage you've got mozaki mage you've got so many decks that are totally revolved around spells and spell damage having a pure on board battle is something we haven't seen in a while and something i'd be very excited to actually see uh in this next going into this next meta um so yeah that's the only two that we have for now for today so a bit of a shorter video um like i said the other cards are going to be revealed at one more well, in my time 1 a.m 3 a.m and 5 a.m so i won't be sitting up for those so tomorrow morning once all those are revealed i'll be dropping another video having a look through those um, and then keep adjusting my schedule according to the reveal schedule and putting out uh, every time a new batch of cards comes out so yeah i'm definitely excited for where this this is heading um, i definitely like the colossal minions and i do hope that they do put a lot more stuff in for a mech mage because that just seems fun to me um something very different for mage um haven't really seen we've seen obviously elementals and stuff go with mage but never mechs with mage just you know the mechanics versus the magic kind of never really played in but this looks like it could really work yeah, so thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, I'll drop another video, like I said, tomorrow. Uh, if you haven't already, please consider su to subscribing to the channel. It does help me, helps the channel grow, um, and helps me get into a place where this can actually start becoming a full-time thing for me. So I'll see you tomorrow. Um, for me, wherever you're watching, hope you have a good morning, good evening, and good night. And I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.